Hello, people of the internet. Right, so I've had a few weeks to reflect, <laughs> and I've come up with the decision that the channel's still growing, still getting subscribers, so something's yeah, going right. And there's a lot of bitter people in the world because <laughs> I'm still getting negative comments. I'm going to start ignoring them now. I've got two options going forward. I ignore them, which yeah, I can quite easily do. Um, I do answer the genuine ones of people that want information, if I can help. I'm no oracle. Um, or I just turn the comments off. There's a solution. Um, I don't want to do that because say, a lot of people do contact you with genuine questions. Anyway, this is not what the video is about. The, the, the video today is a quick update because... Um, I've got back into RC again, RC helicopters. Um, I've always kept a couple of old planes, but I've got some RC helicopters recently. But it's kind of escalated. Um, a friend of mine's getting rid of most of his, and I seem to, every time I go around to see him, end up with a new model. So um, give me a second, I'll show you what's going on at the moment. So the garage is a complete mess. I do apologise. No, I don't. It's my garage. Um, so yeah, I've still got the old um, MX2 up there, which I haven't flown for... God, about five years as you can tell because it's still got the old orange receivers on it there you go i think that might need changing um it's bruised and battered but i think it still flies uh, if not yeah, they're not not expensive and uh, a mig 29 up there which um was a hobby king special and i've only flown a couple of times but helicopters okay so we got the 500 now i did get the 500 up and running and i was going to fly it last weekend but unfortunately the speed controller let go um it just fizzled made lots of noises and, and that was the end of that another one coming another big drama um the 500 sorry 550 l dominator is all back together ready for its first flight um i've changed quite a few bits on that Ironically, because it was crashed, the more I delved into it. Delved into it? Is that a real word? And the more I got into it, <laughs> the more I felt wrong. I think I'm there now. Um, um, the video that got reported and deleted would have shown what happened to that, but I'm not going to go into it. Um, the 550E um, has been probably the best one to put together. Not much wrong with that at all. Just went through it, changed a few bearings, did the usual sort of thing. Um, but I've now got a 470 <laughs> so here is a 470 T-Rex um, it's got Lynx landing gear on it but um, it is the metal head version um, and it is the metal tail version as well so I've kind of set that up for now um, wait for some blades to come um, I think the, the heads, yeah, the, the main shaft's bent as well. Don't, don't know if you can see that, but the main shaft is bent. So a couple of things to do on that, but I have got a canopy for it as well. And with that one came a brand new frame. Never been flown. Now this is the plastic gear on it. Um, it hasn't got the head, but um, yeah, that could turn up <laughs> next time I see Jeff. Um, <laughs> so I don't know what I'm going to do with this one I might put it together as a spare I might not, I don't know yet I don't know, who knows um, I've been charging a few batteries um, with my e-fuel and uh, and here is the iCharger 306B, great little charger really does the job, anybody remember these eh? outrage, what a great helicopter, I had the Fusion 50 amazing helicopter really sad that that um, that that all wound up and, and didn't last very long um also bless jeff's heart um i was given a load of batteries i've gone through them uh there was a, a whole box full of them any ones that are really puffy uh, and any ones that had dead cells got rid of took them down the recycling center but i've got quite a few batteries and i bought a couple of batteries already so i've got some more in here <laughs> these are the best of the bunch so there's some there for the 500 there's some there for the 550e and will obviously fit the dominator as well and a couple of brand new turnages in the corner there that i uh, actually bought um so all i've got to do now is fly now if you're interested in some of the flights i mean there is some old video footage on here of me flying years ago at Forney. but if it's something that interests you let me know and uh 
well, I'll put some more content up. If you're not interested, fine. Not bothered at all. But yeah, I'll, I'm not going to post as much as I used to. Still going to be random. But um, yeah, I've got some things coming up. I've got a holiday coming up, as I mentioned. Um, spoiler alert, it's going to be another cruise, as they are. And um, yeah, that one's a big milestone. That's uh, our 30th anniversary, wedding anniversary. So that should be um, quite an interesting one. Lots of drinks, I'm sure. And I've got a lot to do on the Tigra, which is out there. Hello, Tigra. There he is. Um, so I've got loads to do on the front end of that one. And I've still got all in wraps at the moment. Uh, the bike to do. Got to do the fork seals on it. Take the calves off, give them a good clean. Just get it sorted out, generally, really. Um, hasn't had much money spent on it. Well, since I've had it, to be honest. And it's been... 18 years I had this so um yeah it's due a bit of love and a bit of care I purposely didn't do it over the winter because I weren't going to ride it anyway but the the weather's getting a little bit better now uh, we're just into February at the moment so I want to get it done after I come back off holiday get uh, get the fork seals done at least and then get it MOT'd again so that's what's coming up um again if the comments disappear you know why um, if you want to use uh, negative comments and, and blast me for, for my content, then feel free. Um, but everything now gets uh, reviewed by me, and it probably won't make the channel. Um, if you've got nothing else better to do than leave negative comments, then, well, it's a bit sad, really. Go ahead and have some fun. Life's too short. Right, that'll do for now. I am waffling, as usual. So um, thanks, Internet, for sticking with me. And, um, yeah, let's have some fun together. Catch you later. Bye-bye.